So, you killed your way here? Just so I can pleasure myself with your twitching corpse. <laughs> hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick video to show you a nice, easy way to beat Stump Grinder. Now, there are a few things to note in this fight. Firstly, the soot on the ground is going to show you exactly where the flames will be. Uh, the other thing is that there's a distinctive clicking kind of sound just before the flames appear, so you'll get a bit of warning before they spurt out and start roasting your ass. Okay, in the first part of the fight you do have to deal with Stump Grinder and his followers, but this shouldn't be too much of a problem because the followers are not only damaged by the flame, they're also actually damaged by Stump Grinder's attacks, so um, it's the next part that I'm more interested in when you're alone, all alone with Stump Grinder. So what you want to do is just stand at the base of one of the arcs where the flame comes out and just wait for him to attack you there. You'll be standing sort of near one of the pillars and um, once he's, he's attacked you he'll be sort of stunned for so long that uh, he'll get set on fire and then you just move across to the opposite flame nozzle thing and wait for him to, t to attack you again and get set on fire again. Don't worry if the timing is not quite right because eventually it will be. Um, and you wear him down. Of course once he's almost dead you do actually have to move in and attack him to get that final finishing blow. But that should not be a problem. But that helped. Have fun in game. <laughs>